So, hey, I'm still in Atlanta and enjoying myself. I had to come out here and get some sun before the last class starts. But um, this has been a beautiful, beautifully amazing experience. I have decided that I will be transitioning to ATL. If all things work out well, so when I get home, I really got some stuff that I need to take care of before the transition happens. Last night, we went to a... Um, a wellness spa. J Jeju, Jesu, and Infinite Alchemist had told me about this spa also. And it's um uh, it's a unisex spa, but one side the women are on, the other side the men are on, and then there's a common area in the middle in the middle, and you are nude in this spa. So that was an experience within itself within itself. And it was very beautiful. What I have figured out is that what I've told myself is that these women, these six women that are on this retreat with me, and I didn't know it was going to be a retreat, these women are, this is my tribe. This is my tribe right here. And nothing happens for knots. Nothing happens for not and Everyone that watches my videos, you know, I always say everything happens for a reason. So... I showed up here during this time of a retreat that I didn't know it was going to be a retreat to meet these beautiful, beautiful beings. And we all just mesh like this. Our stories are similar. Um, everyone in here just flowed. We all just really congealed. We all just really congealed. And, of course, the experience at the nude spa last night just really solidified that we are stuck together. These are my boos. While I have, I've been a part of the Sacred Womans of Houston since, I think, 2013, 2014. And I've, I've bumped into a lot of different women, a lot of different sisters. Some I still communicate with, others I don't. Um, I've met women online. and <clears throat> But these six women, they are... They are a part of my my tribe. From wherever I came from, these these sisters are it. They're it. So this whole meetup was divinely orchestrated for various different reasons. And I so give thanks for the opportunity to just leave where I was leave my comfort zone to come to a place that was totally different to me to get the healing that I needed. But yeah, Atlanta is good. And man, let me tell y'all about this this scrub. This <laughs> I got a, a full body scrub which they exfoliate the dead skin off your body. Man, that little Chinese lady scrubbed the hell out of me, y'all. I'm <laughs> she scrubbed the fuck out of me. I came out a few shades lighter. My skin feel better. I ain't even need no lotion this morning. I want to put that little lady in my goddamn purse and take her back home. I want to take her home. And the scrub felt so good. Y'all know I'm X-rated and true. I had to keep myself. Great morning, sis. <laughs> I had to keep myself from having an orgasm. That damn full body scrub was feeling so good. It was just absolutely amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, but... Yeah, that's been my experience thus far here in the ATL. You know, we've laughed, we've cried, we've just, we've gotten real close and personal with each other. And the bond is true with all of us, man. And, I mean, I'm cool. And y'all, guess what? I ain't transitioned. That's what Tracy said last night. You didn't even know you was coming here to get all this. I say, girl, no, I did. She say, and she bust out laughing. She say, your ass telling people, I ain't transitioned yet. I'm still here, y'all. I had to come down here and get a refill. A much needed refill, just a reset. You know, I had to, I had to get some things about my wound about my womb and about my psyche i had found this meditation on youtube a while ago that um you can release ex lovers past lovers all your old lovers out and i did that about two weeks ago i'm gonna try to find that and maybe put it in another video or tell y'all about it later i did that before i came here so and that just popped up on my youtube feed out of nowhere so even that was put into the plan on purpose just for me to get here just for me to get here 
Um, yeah, but I'm just giving y'all an update on what had happened. I feel like a brand new baby since that little Chinese lady scrubbed shit out of me, too. <laughs> I don't got no more dead skin. <laughs> I love y'all. <laughs>